Well, next Wednesday, Coastal Bend residents will have the chance to see something for perhaps the only time in their lives. It's called a super blue moon. Sunrise reporter Roland Rodriguez joins us live, uh, not to moon us this morning, but to explain what it's all about. Hey, Roland. Hi, good morning, Mike, and good morning, South Texas. Uh, the last time this happened is about 150 years ago. That's what I'm, I'm talking about, this rare moon occurrence. Passes into the central part of the Earth's January's moon earns the title of Blood Moon due to the total lunar eclipse, which takes on an eerie reddish hue as it travels through the dark central portions of the Earth's shadow. It's dubbed a blue moon because it's the second full moon of a calendar month, and on January 31st, sky watchers will get a chance to see all three moons in one. While none of these three things is rare on their own, the fact that they're all happening on the same day is pretty remarkable. Uh, it has been about 150 years since the three events have happened on the same day, which is exciting that they're happening now. It's the first time a super blue blood moon will have been witnessed since March 31st of 1866. What's interesting about this happening in January is that we're going to have two full moons in January no full moons in February, and then again two full moons in March. So once in a blue moon, twice this year. As for the eclipse, it will be harder to see in the pre-dawn sky. It will be visible just before sunrise, um, which means you're going to have to wake up pretty early. So weather permitting, it'll be just before sunrise. It will be happening when the moon is setting, so that means it'll be, the moon will be on the western horizon, and that's where you'll need to look. And just in case you're wondering how safe it will be to look at this super blue blood moon with the naked eye, there is good news. The good news about lunar eclipses is that it's perfectly safe to look with just your eyes. You don't need any special equipment um, like you did with the solar eclipse. And if you'd like more information on this super moon, all you have to do is visit our website at KRISTV.com. Reporting live from Shoreline Boulevard, Roland Rodriguez, Chris. Six news. All right. Thank you, Roland. We appreciate that. She said that you have to get up early to see that eclipse. Fortunately, funny thing, <laughs> we get up early. We do indeed. And so we'll uh, see if we can't maybe get that for you.